So with the last update to the game which removes legendary weapons being able to drop from chests, within the Outriders demo a few things have changed and today we check out a new way to farm legendaries since this backend update. How's it going guys my name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders be sure to subscribe. So with the patch which landed today, the 5th of March, a few things have changed within the Outriders demo. The main changes were legendaries being removed from chest. So that 5 chest or 3 chest farm method, you can't actually do it to get those legendaries anymore. Also epics have been removed from vendor stores. In addition to these changes though, people can fly added legendary weapons into the loot pools of side quests. Now all side quests as far as I am aware do indeed have those legendaries within their loot pools and the way in which they work is, and this is important to remember, they are only available in side quests you've completed already. So when you replay them that's where you have a chance of doing that legendary. So if you're doing side quests for the very first time on a fresh character or a new character they won't drop from the side quest then but when you rinse and repeat the side quests as we know within this demo you can rinse and repeat all missions that's when you have a chance of getting them. Also you have to fully complete the side quest which means going back and speaking to the vendor you got the side quest from and that's when you will receive loot. For the most part the loot doesn't actually pop up on your screen either, it's just automatically added into your inventory. So it's best here if you plan on farming side quests to clear out your inventory of items you don't want or hover above all flashing items so once you do get the loot from the side quest you know the actual new piece you got. Now in terms of the fastest side quest to farm, it is without doubt the payback side quest mission. To get this it's pretty simple, pick the third mission down from the lobby menu. Once you spawn in, run to this flag and fast travel here. Once here run up to this lady leaning against this wall and accept the quest and run it. Once you have run it and beat the captain, who I call Captain Wiener, return to the woman. and then you will receive that piece of loot. Remember for the most part it won't notify you you've actually received loot so you just have to check that inventory. And here just simply rinse and repeat, speaking to this woman, repeating the quest. The only thing you can't do is collect the loot at the end of this mission from behind the captain, but you can just keep repeating this side quest without returning to the lobby for a chance at that legendary loot. Now the question is, is running this quest over and over more efficient than farming the OG captain or the vanguard captain? Well the problem is we don't actually know the drop chances at each and the point you can kill the OG captain and the vanguard captain literally 8 to 10 times within the same time you do the side quest once it makes you wonder if it's even worth doing the side quests. Me personally I streamed earlier doing the side quests for literally 3 hours I didn't get a single legendary from the quests yet I went to the vanguard captain during the same stream and got a legendary within 20 minutes. So yeah for now in my opinion I don't think side quests are quicker than farming the captains. But it is just my opinion guys. If we knew drop rates it would make things a lot clearer but for now we don't and if I find out anything new obviously I will let you guys know right here. But yeah I will be back tomorrow with a stream people where you will see me and hopefully see me catching my last 5 legendaries. But on that note guys the end of the video has arrived, if you enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out, if you're new around here and want to see more Outriders be sure to subscribe and hopefully people I will see you on that next one.